Israel, the, the thing with Israel was that because on my on my on my mother's side of the family there's is Jewish ancestry. So what what was happening at the time that coincided with the time that I didn't say was that I was kind of going through this well it's a spiritual journey of course but I was trying to find this kind of I was battling with this whole Judeo Christian kind of belief system what what yeah, yeah, yeah. which is the white right religion and then I discovered this Jewish ancestry on my you know I'm trying to say more of but I mean that it was there but I'd never sort of like really and they was saying oh like yeah there's Jewishness and I'm like okay so I'm like taking up on this so I'm looking into this Judaism now like oh what's this Judaism about and out of the three organized religions Judaism Christianity and Islam mm. that was the first one you know what I'm trying to say so yeah. I was like oh well if that's the first one if that's the youngest one out of the three then obviously that must be the original one in it so I'm thinking I'm getting into my Jewish roots so I'm like I'm like done, done. I'm this is the Jewish thing I'm getting onto this this gotcha, gotcha. Jewish aspect now so that's mm. why I wanted to go to Israel mm. the India thing that was just it was just random it was just totally like totally random but I'm thinking in my head now like yeah I'm gonna go over there just gonna like have a great time gonna you know I'm trying to say you know get some girls get some Indian chicks and just you know, <laughs> that's what I'm thinking in my mind so I'm, I've gone over there now I've checked into the hotel Nice, nice little area, Mumbai and all that lot. And then, and then there's, I, I remember walking down the road and there's this Indian guy and he's gone, he's, he's, um, he's, he's like a guru, he's got like a little kind of like a, like a shop kind of place, whatever. Right, right, right. And he's going, he's going, no, come over here, my friend. He's like, obviously, see me, I'm a tourist. He knows that I'm, I'm not from, from the man. And he's like, yeah, yeah, come on. And I'm like, yeah, 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 I'll see you tomorrow, I'll see you tomorrow. And I kept probably my man off. I kept, mm. him off. I kept saying, yeah, yeah, I'll see you later, I'll see you later, like, I'm on a mission, like, I I'm, I'm want to, you know, I want to I wanna go and check out, you know what I mean, and he's like, okay, okay, and then there were some guys in the hotel, me and them got to be real good friends, and so it, 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 we got to be friends, and, and they were saying, oh, they, they, were told, they were telling me, like, oh, the night before, when, when I went, they said, oh, yeah, man was at some party, like, yeah, man, smashing it, like, Bear chicks and you know what I mean, some nightclub thing. And I was like, yeah, he's going, yeah, yeah, yeah. He goes, you need to be with us, bro. Like, you need to, you need to come. Like, you need to come. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm down. I was like, so when you, when you man going next? He goes, tomorrow night, bro. Like, are you down? And I was like, I said, yeah. He goes, basically, meet us here in the lobby. He goes, the man's coming. It's coming up eight o'clock. He goes, make sure you're here. Like, like, because the, he goes, the guy don't, you don't, you don't wait around. The guy's coming with the car. He's picking us up. Just make sure you're here at eight o'clock. Yeah, 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 you want to yeah. be here like five to eight, cool. But eight, we're leaving. And I'm like, okay, cool. The next day, I've got ready. I'm get I'm getting ready. I'm getting ready. Wanna have a shower, all of that kind of thing. Because I was still doing like, even though I was like out there, I was still cut like because it's quite what is hot out there. I was still like going running and stuff like that, and still doing like my little like exercising just to keep fit and all that look. Anyway, so I'd, I'd, I'd come back from like a little run, like an exercise run. I had something to eat. And I'm looking at the time and I'm saying, right, okay, these man, they're eight o'clock. Okay, seven o'clock, man's jumping in the shower, man's, you know what I mean? I've got the clothes, I'm laying out the clothes. I'm saying, yeah, I know how long it is for me to be in the shower and whatever, I've timed it all perfect. Got in the shower, no water. I'm like, dude, what's going on? There's water, there's water here this morning. What's, what's, what's it? So anyway, I've called the hotel guy. I'm like, dude, like, I think man needs to have a shower. I'm going out in a bit. Like, man needs to. So he's come up. They're, they're figuring around with the thing. They're okay. like, well, I don't know. don't know what's going on. Whatever. They're calling the engineer, whatever. He says, boy, this is not. And this is not like a thing hotel, you know. This is like a, some like, five-star hotel, bro. Like, it's a like, hotel. It's not no, no like, three-star. Yeah. Right? It's like a high-class hotel. Like she's like saying, "Oh, I'm sorry about this," and I'm saying, "Bro, I need to. I'm got. I'm going out, bro. You know, and I need to have the shower. Mm. Two twos. They get the shower on, so I'm there rushing. <laughs> the water's thing. So I'm there rushing. I've seen the time. Boom! I've got my thing on. I got downstairs. Literally, like two minutes past eight, bro. 
I remember coming down the stairs and I remember the elevator opening up and I remember seeing oh. the clock behind the man on the desk and it's two minutes past eight. Yeah. And I got there and the guy, go, uh, the guy, the, um, you know, the, 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 you know, them guys that, you know, when you check into hotels, the guys who help you with the, oh, yeah, 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 like the, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he goes, oh, how you doing? Because he goes, yeah, 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 like, you've got real good buddies. Like, oh, hey, Israel, how you doing? And I was like, yeah, yeah, we're like, where's, um, you know, thing? And he's going, he goes, oh, they just left. <laughs> right. He goes, yeah, they just left. He goes, he goes, they just went outside. So I just, I run outside, I went outside and I went, where like he goes like yeah he goes like the car just came just a moment ago I saw the car pulling up and mm. the man the man that should be outside oh, goes, yeah, guy. the man they're gone bruv <laughs> and could you believe I was standing outside the hotel thinking nah so I was thinking what am I gonna do now I was all dressed up or whatever guess who hollers at me got you my man the Indian guru for because yeah oh my man I'm like ah oh, <laughs> <laughs> I've got time for you now yeah <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking. This can't be real, like you know what I mean. But okay, I thought okay, I'll go, I'll go and see my man. So he's there telling me he does the astrology thing. He goes, yeah, you have your time of birth and all that lot. And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. man, man knows, I know my date of birth, time of birth. So boom, boom, boom. You know what I mean? So like, it, and because it, I, I know obviously he's got, you know, obviously he's running the business, he's an astrologer, which is what I am now. But he's, but so I'm thinking like, well, how much is it gonna cost? Because I know you're looking at money, like. <laughs> But he told he told me how much it is, and compared to obviously the pound, it's like it's P like, I don't think it's minor. It's like it's not even a fiver. Like yeah, yo, do, do your thing, innit? Here's my date of birth. Here's my thing. And the first thing he said, bruv, he did the chart, and the first thing he said was something happened with your mum last year, and that was it. Because mm. I thought I ain't told this guy shit. All I told him is my date of birth, time of birth, place of birth. That is it. The man drew me out a chart and he goes, something happened. He goes, something like, like difficult happened with your mom last year. He goes, yeah. And he goes, boom, boom, boom. And he, not, not only did he say last year, he told me because she, and she died in February. He gave me, he, he, told, he said it was, it, was, it was like early of the year because it would have been around like January, February, around that time that's when the thing happened like with your mm. mom and I was mm. like shit so he's there now giving me the reading boom, 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 boom. and then he goes to me he goes yeah you should be doing this and I was like dude bruv I'm man's a boxer innit like <laughs> <the> man... <laughs> man's a boxer <laughs> yeah. I said I'm a boxer what are you talking about like then this said this, 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 he's like yeah no he said, he said like you should be doing this he goes like he goes, your chart's very spiritual and, you know, so you're saying all that. I'm hearing it, but I'm like, yeah, yeah, like, that's like, can you see me becoming a world champion? Like, like the boxing, like, what's, what's happening with that? Like, he's saying, nah, like, he goes, he goes, he goes, I'm seeing, he goes, yeah, you see, he said, you should be doing, like, gym work, like, exercise and keep, he goes, yeah, that's very good for you. And, like, you should be doing things like that, but not as a job. Mm. So I was thinking, bro, okay, uh, you got my mom thing right. He, he said some other things as well that was like, okay, he was on point with that. But I'm saying with the job thing, like, cool, isn't it? So I wrapped up the, you know, what I mean, the, the birth chart. I paid him. He was cool. He was cool. He was a good, nice guy and everything. Yeah. Took it. Didn't think nothing of it. Then went to Israel the following week. Now. Oh yeah. So I'm in Israel. I checked this one out. So I'm in Israel now, I'm in Jerusalem. And then where I was staying with the hotel, again, I've met these guys, you know, I'm trying to say, me and them were cool. In the evening, we'd go to the city centre, you know, them, I mean, I didn't drink, but them and they used to like to have a little drink or whatever. They were stubborn. So they were out there. So one night, um, I'd, I'd gone out with them. We don't linked up. I'd, I'd gone out with them. And they were, what it was is like, because there was kind of like a group of us, we'd all walk back to like, we'd all come back to the hotel um, uh, uh, together. Mm. So, and we'd come back maybe about, I don't know, like 12, one o'clock, around them time there, late, you'd come back, come back to the hotel, man would go, go to there. So anyway, um, we were out one evening, I've seen a bunch of girls in it, and I said, bruv, 
I'm on this, you know, like I'm, I'm jumping on this, yeah, I'm jumping on this girl thing. I don't know about you, man, but I'm jumping on this girl thing. So they're like, yeah, 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 yeah. cool, cool, cool. So anyway, I'm, I'm, getting, I'm talking with this girl. Girl telling me how she lives in Israel, all that lot, and I'm like, yeah, I'm on, I'm on this. Like, yeah, me and you, I'm, I'm, I'm getting this. So anyway, we're talking, we're talking. So then the guys are going back. So they're going, yo, Israel, we're going, and I'm like, bro. Go in it, like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm grown. You not go. I'm I'm on this thing, yeah. I'm I'm looking to I'm looking to I'm looking to get late tonight, yeah. You you lot go. So we're we're talking. So they've left me. I'm by, I'm by myself, and they're still like, "Oh, you 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 sure you're gonna be alright?" I'm like, yeah, "I'm alright." Like, no, who's man's gonna trouble me? I'm a boxer, innit? Like, who's gonna who's gonna who's gonna end with me? You know what I mean? So I'm like, yeah, okay. So I'm talking to this girl now. We're talking, talking, and then. At the end of the night, she's with, um, she, she gave me a number. She told me where she lives. She said, like, boy, she's got to wake up early in the morning and go. She goes, so nothing can't really go on tonight. You know, I'm trying to say something like, okay, cool, fair enough. Come on, so we kind of thing. We've had a little kiss and all that kind of thing. You know, touched her up and stuff. And I'm like, okay, cool. So I'm going back to the hotel now. So I'm going back to the hotel. Now, there was two ways to get back to the hotel. And there was one way, it was like, the the, the 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 there was one way that was like it was like a little alleyway kind of you have to go through this like kind of it's not it's not it's an alleyway it's a bit a little bit dark but not you know what I'm trying to say but at night there yeah. there'd been a few incidences where some people have gone down the alleyway so there there, it, there was word about like they were saying telling people like oh don't go down there like just go round but the round way was like the long route. Gotcha. If you get what I mean, so people didn't really want to go down the wrong long route. Some people, so if there was a when we would go, when, when me and the guys were coming back, we go down the alleyway in it because yeah. there's a group of us, so I was like, there's a group of us in it. So I'm coming back now and I'm thinking, so I chance this, I said it, man. I'm going down the alleyway, man. So I thought I'm going down there myself. So I'm going down the alleyway and I'm hearing some drums. I'm thinking, drums, right? I'm walking, I'm walking, and I'm hearing the drums getting a bit louder, they're getting a bit louder, they're getting a bit louder. And I'm like, where are these drums coming from? And I'm just, just walking, I'm still walking, walking back to the hotel, didn't think nothing of it. And as I walk past, I see this little, it's like a, it's a shop, it was, well, it was a shop. It's like a coffee shop. And they've done it like, like Moroccan style. It's kind of, you've got cushions on the floor. Mm. Man's up in there smoking shisha. Man's yeah, yeah. up there smoking um, uh, the, the the pipe thing there. Man's yeah, man's on the shisha thing. Man's and then there's this guy there and he's just fiddling around with the drums, kind of thing. He's got mm -hmm. some little drums there and he's like beating the drums. Some like white guy with dreads. You know what I mean? He's like beating the drums and I'm like, bro, what's going on? So I, I I I just put my head in there. See the man smoking. People having like cups of tea and all that lot. And it's just like. It's a nice vibe, dim lights, red lights, and I'm thinking, well, so I'm standing at the door looking in, like thinking, well, what's, I've never seen this before. Mm. I, I, I've been coming past here like a good few days now, and I've, I ain't seen this before. So I'm in there, and I'm like, and then the woman goes, come in. I see the woman, I think she, she runs it, and she's going, like, hey, come in. She goes, yeah, come in. Like, you're welcome, you're welcome. So I've come in, and I'm like, boy, what's, what's, what's this about? And she goes, no, people just come here, they just chill. They just relax. It's just a, it's just a cool place. We're open till late. Um, mm -hmm. Like yeah, have a have, have a sit down. And basically, there was a rabbi. <clears throat> there was a rabbi sitting there on on the thing yeah. there, and he was there. He was just having a cup of tea. Comes there regular. Everybody pretty much there were regulars. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? So she was mm -hmm. like, yeah, just sit down and just. So I was like, okay, cool. So I've, I've sat down, sat down right next to the rabbi. See, the, at first I didn't even know it was a rabbi because he got there. He's taking off his hat or whatever, but he's having the thing. Mm -hmm. And look, due to me and him, I got talking, and he's like, "Yeah, it's a nice vibe, isn't it?" And yeah, yeah. And like my man's just beating the little drums, you know. what I'm trying to say just like a little tone, like kind of little beating the drum. And now and again, like somebody would get up and do a little silly dance or something like that, and sit back down. Mm -hmm. And yeah, yeah, it was just, yeah. just not, it was a nice vibe. And I was thinking, okay, this is this is cool. This is chilling. You know what I mean? So I'm there talking up with the rabbi now. And I'm, um, you know, where are you from? All that lot. So I'm telling him from London and stuff. And he's he, he's there talking. And then he, he's um, um um he goes um so he asked my name. He goes Israel. He goes oh Israel. He goes okay. How how you get that name? Yeah. And I was so I tell him I said well my mom's side you know there's there's Jewish ancestry there's Jewish linkage there. 
So my grandma told my mum to name me Israel, and he goes, okay, okay, okay. So you say, oh, so, so you're Jewish. He goes, and then he goes to me, do you know what your name means? Um, and I said, um, I said, yeah, it means he, he who struggled with God. You know, that's, the, that's what the meaning is in Hebrew, you know what I mean? So I said, he who fought with God, he who struggled with God. He goes, yeah, 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 yeah. He goes, yeah, you know, you know, you know, you know who Israel was in the Bible, right? And I was like, yeah. I said, yeah, of course. Yeah, it's Jacob, isn't it? And then he changed his name to Israel. So I'm giving him the lowdown and he's, he's yeah. there nodding and he's nodding. He goes, yeah, yeah. So he goes, you know who Jacob is, right? And I go, yeah, 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 I know Jacob, innit? Jacob's one of like some Jacob and Esau and all that lot. And, yeah. and he's going, he's going, yeah, yeah, yeah. He goes, yeah, but you know what the story's trying to tell you? And I was like, yeah, I know the story, innit? Man knows the story about Abraham. Abraham has the, you know what I mean? He has, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? The, 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 the twins, Jacob and Esau and all that. So I'm telling him about it. So he's like, yeah, he goes, but you, you don't know. He's like, he goes, yeah, but you know the meaning of the story. And I was like, no, what was the meaning of the story? And he goes, he goes, it's all astrological, bruv. Mm. I thought, okay. He goes, yeah, he goes, what he goes, what do you think? He goes, what do you think the 12 tribes of Israel are about? He goes, the 12 tribes of Israel are the 12 zodiac signs. I was like, okay, cool. Like, I hear you. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say, but I just weren't thinking, you know what I mean? He goes, yeah, because you've got to know like your astrology. Like, if you know your astrology, you know. You know what I'm trying to say? So he goes, oh, he goes, like, what star sign are you? Do you know your star sign? I goes, yeah, I'm, I said, I'm Libra. And he goes, oh, Libra. Oh, yeah, you belong to, you know what I mean? You're the tribe of this, you know, he's connected with this tribe. And we're to, so he's talking, right, I'm right, talking right. about that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, and he goes, yeah. So basically, he, he says, listen, I, he said, he said, how long are you over here for? I think I'd been there for about, like, four, four, five days or something like that. I think I had about, like, two, three days left, something like that. And I remember, I was like, I'm going to, I'm checking out. So he goes, listen, he goes, come and see me. Boom, 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 man writes out his number, gives me his address, he goes, yeah, come and see me before you go, basically. That man will, you know what I'm trying to say. Man went to go see the man. You know what the Ross Clark man did? He did me another astrology chart. I didn't even tell him about India and what all The man did yeah, me yeah, another yeah, astrology yeah, chart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man did me astrology chart saying, boom, 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 was telling me all that. Again, certain things were coming in, but not all. I was, it's almost like I took what I wanted to take kind of thing. But he was saying, like, listen, when you get back to the UK, like, start studying, start, start, you know what I mean? Start your studying, start looking into all this mysticism, yeah. Kabbalah, all this kind of stuff. And I was like, yeah, yeah, cool, cool. Anyway, come back to UK now. Had another fight. The first fight I won. But I won, but again, didn't look good in the fight so it's like yeah. mm, you know what i mean yeah the, maybe the death of your mum's still kind of there kind of thing or whatever had the fight i, I think i had about like one or two fights actually i had, had like two fights and i won them and then it was like the third fight or something like that i lost again and again it was like this kind of caliber fighter you know you should be winning yeah yeah you know it's, it's not like so anyway i lost with that one again just going through like, just days, like, just didn't quite know where I was, hanging on to this Jewish thing, what's going on with that, you know, that kind of thing. And I'm like, okay. <coughs> um, and then I go down, do you know what? To this day, I can't tell you why I was in East London that day. Because I lived in Northwest. And how I ended up on Clarence Road, what the hell I was doing down there, okay. I don't know. And I walked into Sister Rosanna's shop. Mm. And I was walking, and I remember I was looking, she had like, the tapes with the lectures and all that lot, and books. So I was just like, looking at some of the books, and she goes, oh, what are you looking for? I was like, oh, you got anything on Judaism? And you know, I was trying to say, you got anything on the, you know what I mean? It wasn't even like, and she was like, yeah, she goes, yeah, there's a few books over there. I remember I picked out one or two books, spirituality, you know, that kind of thing. Uh, some spiritual books or whatever, I picked it up and I was like, I, was, I said, I'll buy that. And then I was looking at the tapes and Sister Rosanna was talking to me and she goes, ah, what, 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 um, uh, we, we were talking and then she said, I remember she said something, she goes to me, um, uh, she goes, yeah, she goes, um, she goes, yeah, maybe, um, she goes, oh, do you know a lot about this spiritual? I goes, I know a little bit. 
you know what I mean? I, not nothing major. She goes, oh, she goes, um, because maybe you should, maybe you should talk about it. What are you chatting about, man? Like, to talk about what? Like, she goes, yeah, she goes, maybe you should start teaching it. Maybe you should, maybe you should, you know what I mean? And I was thinking, are you for real? Like, and she goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. She goes, I've got a little space back of here. You know what I mean? I'll clear out the, the back and, and like, you, you, you can, you, you can come and talk. Like, you can come and, you know, you know, do the talk thing. And I was like, boy, I don't know if I'm ready for that, you know? And she's like, no, man, like, you're ready, man. Like, you, you know something. <laughs> And I'm like, boy, I don't know. I'll see. I'll see how it goes, innit? <laughs> so me and her did vibe. I was there for a couple of hours. I bought some tapes. Mm. Took bought, like the Bobby Hemet, uh, 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 Dr. Ben. I think I bought like a Dr. Ben, your Cannon one, uh, uh, Bobby Hemet. I must have bought a, bought a Bobby Hemet one and, and some other ones. So I was listening to them. I was like, right, oh, like, what's this? this, this? Things kind of deep. <laughs> what's, this, what's, what's this all about? You know what I mean? And I'm hearing, not totally getting it, but I'm hearing all this, yeah, and all this, and yeah, the man's came it and all this. And I'm like, okay, okay, what's, 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 what's this? And then I'm hearing Dr. Ben Yokanan saying about, oh, yeah, the, the Jews ain't the original Jew, and like they stole the thing from Kemet. And I'm like, dude, what's this? What's going on? Like, I'm still holding on to that. We're the first ones, innit? We're the Jews, man. What are you talking about? Like, so I'm still battling, I'm going through this kind of, battle and that went on for like a good um uh a uh, uh, couple months then what had happened was in it was 2005 2005 and it was after the bombings after this uh the 77 bombing because it was on the 7th of july 2005 and it added up to to the 7 and it was then, not what it what no it, before the bombing, before about like about two two three months before the bombing. I'd gone into Sister Rosanna's shop, and Sister Rosanna goes, "You're speaking next week, bruv. And I was like, "What?" She goes, "Bruv, I've got a little space here. You're speaking," and I was like, "What? What am I going to talk about?" She goes, "Talk about anything." And she just took me around the back and like you know what I mean, cleared the place. And she goes, "Yeah, here it is." And I remember went in there, there was me, there must have been about, I don't know, five, six people, something like that. That's how I started off, like the first one. And then oh, so tell me now, sorry to cut you, we're gonna get back. Yeah, that yeah, was yeah, the yeah. first time you spoke at Rosanna's. Yeah. Was that the first time you spoke ever, probably? Was that Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Fucking hell, bro. Because I was there, I was there, in it. Like, I'm just thinking like <laughs> the history of the build up to get to that point, and it's like it was you and Galactic Clive. That's who I'm looking yeah, to get. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was yeah, the seven yeah, seven. Yeah. That was the seven seven. Yeah. Remember that, bro? I still got the DVD, bro. Yeah. I still got the DVD. That was the seven. That was the, that was the seven seven. That's okay. when I met bro Galactic Clive. That was after the seven seven thing. Got you, got you. Because and she said, "Yeah, boom, like yeah, yeah, like you, you, you're speaking." Yeah. And I was like, "Whoa!" And boom, you know what I'm trying to say? I just thing, and then you know what I mean. Did my thing on the numerology, just spoke about the astrology and, and stuff like that. And you killed it, um, bro. I remember that. You killed it. You killed it. You yeah, 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 yeah. You killed it, man. Yeah, man. You know what I mean? I'm just putting Thanks. it together. And then it just kind of just started, that journey kind of just sprung from there, you know what I'm trying to say? And then next minute I know I'm doing talks and, you know what I'm trying to say? And it's like, okay, there's, you know, there's, 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 there's you know, there's, there's something here. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. You know what was f funny again with that? was around that time, I had a friend called Troy. Good friend of mine, I've lost contact with him. I, I, I'm still trying to find whether, you know what I mean? Good friend of mine, me, me and him, like, we used to link up all the time, he used to come to my fights, support me and everything, his name was Troy. And he, he, he came, and it was round about that time there where I just started, first started lecturing or whatever. He, 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 he I remember he came to mind one day and we were talking and he said to me, um, because he was saying, well, the boxing thing, are you, are you still doing it? And I was like, you know, I'm trying to say, it's kind of like half of me was in it, but half of me wasn't even in it no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm yeah. trying to say, it's kind of like I'd, I'd lost the, the spirit in it kind of thing. And he was saying like, boy, I remember he said to me, he goes, boy, if, if you need any guidance, he goes, I know this woman. He goes, I've been going to her for years. He goes, my mum used to go to her. She's a reader, mm -hmm. basically. Basically, she's a reader, like a medium. He goes, my mum went to her. And from I was young, she used to take me to her. 
And when I became of age, I used to go to her myself. She goes, basically, basically she'd been reading for us for like over 20 years, bro. And I was like, right, seriously? And he goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, my girl's like, she's, she's the shit. Mm-hmm. And I, he goes, if you want, he goes, I give you her detail, uh, give, give you her details and you can contact her. She goes, she's really good. Like, she will help you out or give you some guidance and stuff like that. So I was like, okay, okay. I goes, because um, uh, I said to him, I goes, yeah, man, when, when I was in India and Israel, man's telling me about this spiritual astrology team. But, man's like, hey. but I wasn't I weren't really in it. Like, I, I'd, I'd kind of just put it to the side kind of thing. I was still kind of battling with this whole boxing thing and stuff. So I, he goes, yeah, he goes, yeah, no, contact her. So he gave me a number. I rang her up. And then she said to me, she goes, she goes, okay, basically what it is, um, because she, she was a bit, quite a bit elderly, you know what I mean? And then she said, basically, that she said, she, she, goes, she goes, I still do the readings, but I don't do it in the way that I normally, she goes, before I'd give you my address and you'd come down in it and then you'd mm. I'd do the reading. She goes, I don't do it like that anymore. She goes, I've stopped because I've become of age. And she goes, where I used to be, she said, um, um, she goes, she'd moved, like she's moved to another place that's quite far just like, not too far, but it's just outside of London. So she goes, I do it on the phone. I said, oh, okay, okay. So I said to her, I said, so how, how do I pay you then, like, if you're doing it over the phone? So she goes, she gave me her address, and she gets, she said, like, oh, God, back then, it's like... Uh, postal orders. Postal checks, yeah, postal <laughs> orders. Yeah, postal, yeah. So I went and got the postal orders, write her name, boom, 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 send her the money. And then she goes, do you, she goes, have you got a picture of you, like a photo of you? And I said, yeah, 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 like, yeah. So I cut the photo put it in there. She goes, if you've got a little picture of you, just put it inside because I just need to have a picture of you. Mm-hmm. I sent her the picture, I sent her the truck checks uh, and then we arranged, I rang her up and then we arranged the time when we were going to do the recording or whatever. She goes, yeah, yeah. So, um, and then within that time, I'd seen Troy again in it and I told her, I told, I told him, I said like, oh, she's not doing the readings like how you used to go to her no more. She's moved back. She goes, oh, oh, right, cool, cool. She goes, yeah, no, no worries. He goes like, but she's cool, she's still, like she, she'll hook you up. So on the day, I rang her up, house phone, I'll never forget it. And I was standing, because I had like a little, like a bed sit thing in Bell's Heights Park. Mm. And I was standing at the window and I had the phone in my hand. And then I rang her up and I goes, yeah, yeah you're all right. And then she said, yeah, yeah. And then she goes, she goes, just give me a few minutes, kind of thing. Uh, she goes, I just need to tune in, kind of thing. So it's tuning in, tuning in, tuning in. And ju- just before I go into what she said, you see, just before my mom died, mm-hmm. what it was is she was in St. Thomas's Hospital, innit? She, she had she had like a stroke kind of thing. She was in St. Thomas's Hospital, 